What's up guys, it's me with another quick video here. So um, I've kind of decided against doing the uh, 40 breeder as a planted tank. Uh, just for the pure fact of, um, you know, a couple of you guys brought up a good point. I didn't, I was going to be downsizing the big reef tank because I didn't really have time for the maintenance. So it would be kind of stupid to put together a 40 gallon breeder planted tank with, uh, I mean, a new trimming and all that good stuff. So, um, going ahead and selling that tank. I already got the uh, AI Soul light sold. Uh, so, what I'm going to do is actually turn this little 12-gallon uh, nano tube into a planted tank. Um, something I'm really excited about. I really want to do a planted tank. I love, love the reef hobby, but, you know, branching out into the planted world, uh, I've been wanting to do for quite a while. I just have no idea how to go about setting up a planted tank. Um, but right now I got a little bit of a foundation. I was going to be setting this tank up anyways for uh, my daughter. We're going to do glow fish. Probably still going to do the glow fish, but with plants now. Um, so what I have so far is the tank, <laughs> cycle tank. Uh, no plant substrate yet. And then I have this uh, 20 watt, 6500K uh, flood LED light. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen uh, Corvus. Uh, he uses these on his uh, his planted tanks. Um, well, I don't know. It looks like he's been breaking them down quite a bit lately. But uh, you know, shout out to you, Corvus. Uh, good on you for getting uh, getting your life straight and shit. Uh, anyway, so uh, this is kind of what I got going on here. It's going to be kind of a slow build. Um, I'm going to get some substrate and then start thinking about what I want to do for plants and how I want to lay plants out in this thing. Uh, if anybody's got any tips on planted tanks, that would be awesome to hear. Um, like I said, just because I don't really know the route to take for a planted tank, it kind of sounds silly, but I'm a reef guy. What do you expect? So, uh, yeah, that's what we got going on now. Um, again, if you guys have any advice for me on planted tanks, that'd be really great to hear what type of plant, um, a good substrate. I really don't want to spend like $100 on like that Amazonia crap, um, even though one bag would probably do just fine for this tank. That's just that's a lot of money for just the substrate, which is crazy. So, uh, anyways, uh, we'll see you guys in another video. Um, hopefully I can get some feedback from you guys because I really, <laughs> I'm doing some research on this planted tank stuff, but as of right now, I don't know a whole ton about it. So, alright guys, we'll see you in the next time.